am going to be turning regular logos spooky. Up first I did Wendy's, which I renamed to Witchies. I took out the font in Photoshop from Wendy's and I replaced it with this one called Mr. Darcy that I think kind of looks Salem witchy. And for Wendy, I decided to make her skin green, her hair black, and the bows red to kind of give an Elphaba vibe. I drew a witch hat with the pen tool and here's the final result. I love how this one came out. It looks kind of like retro scary. Up next I did Pokemon, which I renamed Spookymon. My idea was to make the O's in Spooky be the eyeballs of the ghost Pokemon Gengar. I gave everything a purple stroke and then decided to actually add his ears in there. I made all the rest of the letters orange and here's the final result. I'm actually blown away by how much this one looks like it could be real. Up next we have Fruit of the Loom, aka Fruit of the Gloom. But this one I went in on Procreate and decided to add a knife so it looked like it was going into the apple. I made that kind of in the same style of the Fruit of the Loom logo, added a pool of blood to the bottom, and finally a snake. I changed the words to be a different font called Escoffier, and here's the final result. First of all, I just can't get over how fun the name is, and second of all, I love how it looks. And last but not least, we have Hardy's, aka Heldies. For this, I also brought it into Procreate, changed the star black, and outlined it in red to make it look like a pentagram. Then I kind of rearranged how his face looked to make him look angry, put it back into Photoshop, and replaced the font with this chiller font in red, and here's the final result. This one is probably like the scariest looking one of all, but I'm really happy with how it came out. Let me know what you think in the comments.